Well, today NASA is hosting Space Day over at the state capitol, and Jacqueline Sarkeesian is there live and joins us now oh. inside. Oh, oh, wow. Inside a space suit. <laughs> wow. So this is something people can I check know. out over there today. Feeling. I know it's so cool. So this is one of them. And then there's another another thing where, you know, it's like a cardboard cutout and you can stick your face through it. So this is pretty cool. I was hoping this would be here. So let's take a walk over here. There are so many cool things happening, like what I just went into. And now a real life astronaut, Rex Wellheim. Thank you so much for being with us. It's my pleasure. It's great to be here in Austin today. So you have been to space three times. Tell us about that experience. Yeah, it's an amazing experience to have a chance to get launched off this planet and then uh, see the world from a vantage point of uh, 250 miles up when you're going 25 times the speed of sound. Go around the world every 90 minutes. It's absolutely amazing. Wow. How many days have you spent total in space? About 36 days and three, and three shuttle missions. So my first two missions were to help build the space station. And we put uh, new pieces on the space station. And the third one was the final space shuttle mission to help resupply the space station. Now, did you always know growing up you wanted to be an astronaut or how does someone decide one day they want to go to space? Well, it's one of those dreams you have and if you keep pursuing it, it can possibly come true. Now, I didn't take it real seriously when I was younger, when I was a kid. It's something I dreamed about and read books about. And then as I got closer and went through college and got some experience, I thought, well, maybe this is uh, something I could really do. So I pursued it and was able to do it. So it's space day here in Texas. We're at the Capitol. NASA's here. You're here. What is this day all about? Yeah, we're trying to show the uh, impact that NASA has on our community, basically, and also what the great things we're doing and the way we're reaching out to uh, high school scholars and want us to uh, thank the legislators for their support to some of these programs and just understand what it is we're up to down at the Johnson Space Center and around the state and the various parts of the space industry. So when people come, not only can they go into a space suit, what else can they do here? Okay, we can look at all the various exhibits to see what we're doing, uh, the various programs, the, the exploration vehicles we're working on, some of the different aerospace companies, what they're working on, bringing on the next generation of vehicles. We're, we're really uh, working hard on getting uh, the capability to launch astronauts from the United States again. I was on the last space shuttle mission, and so now we're uh, getting to do it from the space station with our Russian Soyuz rockets, but uh, we're building some exciting ones with Boeing and, uh, and SpaceX to take our astronauts to and from the space station, and then NASA is working on deep space vehicle. So we're, they can hear about all these different great programs we're working on. On. Well, awesome. Thank you so much for joining us. Dave, Amanda, Lauren, Zach, this is open until 5, so all of you have plenty of time to walk across the street, come here to the Capitol, and then you guys yourselves can go into this space suit. Back yep. to you in the studio. Yeah, very close to us. What a cool experience. I'm sure a lot of folks will be out there today. Jacqueline, thank you.